Hello everyone, Santa Duck 2, and welcome to another mod overview, this time on Zycraft, a mod that pretty much was around in 1.7, and uh, is a mix of decoration and technology. So, what you do is pretty much go between different ores, such as aluminium or the Zycorium, and uh, yeah, you pretty much can just make any of the sort of decoration blocks you can see here, and some blocks, like the plate or the shield, could be used for blast resistance or um, certain, I guess, hardness in a way, similar to obsidian. Um, other than that, you could use certain things like the glass for a tank or certain other bits and pieces. Now, I don't know if there is certain unique aspects to this in this version, um, or it is actually more similar to the 1710 that never happened publicly enough. Um, so yeah, we'll just see in that what we can do, uh, otherwise there is a few bits and pieces here and there um, with information, but there is no fabricator, there's no tanks, there's no other certain things, um, there's no water blocks, um, but there is a few pretty much core features like the ores and decoration and um, world gen and other stuff, so we'll cover what we can with that. I'm just getting to the screen of course. Alrighty, so we'll just get started with the ores, of course, because they're the thing you'll probably come across first and need to really know before you can approach many of these. So there is pretty much five different coloured Zycorium ore. Uh, there is aluminium or aluminum, and there is obviously quartz. So you've got, in just no particular order, you've got light, you've got dark, you've got red, you've got green, and you've got blue. So if we just go to, for example, here for fortune as well, we'll just get some quartz, which you can also stack here, if you can see there. But you'll find up to about four of this maximum in the, the following, you can apply up to five. Let's go to survival, and we'll just go here, and we'll see what happens. We're getting five, I assume it's just giving us as many as I've already placed here, yep. And with the ore, we'll just use fortune on it. Okay, so we'll just get that, so five that time. We'll try again from scratch though. So we've got one there, which you can get about one to three with fortune, as far as I've seen with the my page, with the download page. So one to three is possible with fortune. Uh, otherwise, you can find the ores between zero and 64. I'm pretty sure that's all of them, even the quartz and the aluminium. And uh, yeah, so we'll just break through all these, you get an idea. So that's what the crystals look like. Uh, blue, green, red, dark, and light kind. Okay. So there's that, and that's obviously what our chances were there. So we'll just remove these. Now you can find the ores, the Zycorium particularly, uh, surrounded by Zycorite, which is kind of being replaced by stone in a way, or the ores are being replaced by stone as a chance for world gen. Uh, but you'll find these in the world, and if you find this, then uh, you'll see the ores pretty much nearby, um, sort of just like on the side or in the sort of vein of what's here. And uh, the vein sizes of the ores can pretty much be, I think, about 17 maximum. Um, I assume that is or isn't including the Zycorite as well. Um, so, yeah. Uh, otherwise, though, we'll just go through each of these so you can get an idea. Um, the aluminium, of course, so that we'll get. Uh, now, I do have another mod installed, so it's not giving me the exact aluminium or aluminium that I want. Um, you typically get, uh, let me just see here, you'd get this type, pretty much. So, that sort of plate ish looking one or sort of little thing there. Um, but obviously you can smelt or blast. So, yeah. Otherwise, we'll get to some of the other stuff, of course. So, oops. So, like so. So you've like, got Psychorite, which obviously you find in the world. You can make um, Psychorized, which is like so, which is pretty much just, I think, um, Psychorite, except with obviously the um, sort of cracks having the particular different types of crystals. You can also use a stone cutter for many of these as well, which is the small bricks and a few others, as you can see there. So there's stone cutter support. And otherwise you've got a sort of 
storage block or a smooth or something else of the Zycorite block. So you can go back and forth. You've got Zycorite bricks, which you can make them small or the regular. And the small is pretty much just the following like that. Between them, probably best to use a stone cutter if you want to go between them without, I guess, uh, the other one crafting. Uh, you've got aluminium or aluminum. You've got small bricks of those, and regular bricks and such, which obviously I've got presented. Whoops, I don't want to take too much damage from that. Oh well, that's not what I wanted. Um, so we want to teleport to what, 4, 100, and maybe 89, I think it was. Oh, great. And taking 4 damage that I don't want to take. Okay. I'm pretty sure that was it. Yep, we're close enough. Alright, so yeah, quartz does actually have you take damage, which uh, mobs can also take damage, items can be destroyed, and uh, you can get stuff that actually goes into here, which I think it's mostly going in there, it's actually destroying it. Yeah, you just do that, that'll pick that up, but uh, no, because it doesn't destroy it, okay, interesting. So for mobs, obviously they do get attacked and take damage, which the more crystals you have, the more damage they'll take. Of course, which obviously each crystal is each damage. So a zombie will take like four hits for sure, real quick. We're obviously moving back to the decoration stuff. So we've got that. And the flesh will go through. And uh, otherwise they can be stacked on the side or presented on the side. So yeah. So we'll move back to the other decoration stuff. And get rid of the rain. Alright, so you get your different blocks of the Regular variety, which is stone bricks or mossy bricks or whichever you have, and Zycorium, and then the small versions. And you can see many of those there, so they obviously have an animation as well as some lighting to them. So you regular, small. Um, there's a solid version if you prefer, which is just the regular and stone. There's obviously small brick versions, and there's obviously the Zycorized, like so on the side, which is just Zycorite and Zycorium blocks. So that's many of the blocks that you'll encounter there. There's also the Illuminized compared to the uh, Zycorized one. So there's your light and dark variations there. Uh, you've got obviously storage blocks, or the aluminium ones here, or aluminium ones here, and then quartz. So there's dark, light, green, blue, quartz, aluminium, Bricks of those kinds, red and quartz, and then bricks and other things. So that's uh, moving on. We've got obviously the glass viewer and other types of ones. So there's different designs. So there's the glass viewer, like so, with iron and glass. So this is sort of like your typical glass of the mod. You've got the dire one, which has obviously none of the extra on it, and is made with quartz and so on. So it's more clear. You can see, just from the different side even. Uh, you've got the aluminium one, or aluminium, which is just that, in comparison to iron or quartz in the recipe. Reinforced, which is just a stronger one, as strong as obsidian, I assume, like the recipe is. And you've got obviously phantomized, which is pretty much just phantom membranes, surrounded by many of the others, I think. Uh, yeah, and these obviously allow you to walk through them. So you can walk through any of the other types that you had, dark, the reinforced, the regular, the dire, the whichever. So these you can walk through. Um, obviously I forgot to cover the dark, um, which is, yeah, because it's glowing, is uh, dark and immortal. Um, glowing version, dark version, and so on, we'll get to those. So you've got glowing, which is just a glowing dark, a glowing glass, glowstone and glass, the Korean one, if that's what we want. Then we have a dark one, which is for keeping in darkness. Which is black dye. And the immortal, which is just the following here, which I think is supposed to be stronger glass, but I don't know. I've tried an explosion. I don't really know the point of it. Let me just take a look. Uh, it can be recolored. Okay, so can we just use this? We cannot. Can we use the color scan then? Uh, so we got that there. Can we get another block? 
I don't know what the case is. Do I need like a wool block or a plate block or something like that? I really don't know enough about the color scheme and I don't know anything, so. Um, I guess maybe you can use the molded block with it. I have absolutely no idea. Unless it's just the first thing I selected. Yeah, so apparently you can. So I assume you use maybe the immortal block with that and it changes. Um, but yeah. Otherwise, you got the Zycorium lamp and the inverted one. If you want some lighting. So this is the regular. And obviously the inverted is pretty much the exact same, but obviously turned on already. Inverted. I'll just get rid of that. So obviously it's now off. Uh, otherwise, the only other things really left to show is obviously the sort of aluminized engineering blocks and such, which has that sort of look. The Zycorium one, or Zycorized, so that, and then Zycora, and then Redstone, and the same, but obviously with aluminum or aluminum. And that is that. Uh, the last two is the shield and the plate. Uh, I was trying to attempt the tank, but uh, obviously the tank isn't available yet. Um, but what you can do with these is pretty much the same as a thing to, you know, house a creeper or with a blast. Where is it? Here we go. So plates can bear the explosion of creeper, not a powered one. And this shield has a resistance of obsidian. So just get some TNT. So you use these for like protection and such against mobs. Keeping them out. Okay, so we'll just do this. Now this is a non-powered one, and I've tried redstone and I haven't gotten it working, so that's not going to last as much. Uh, this will. No, not too much for light, but either way, nothing was destroyed at all, so it's quite tough. So you need obsidian and everything else there, and then the other is just iron. So yeah. I don't know how you power this one though. I don't think you can power them. Um, unless obviously more in the future. Um, if I can go off what I remember of the original version of the mod. So we can try that. Nothing. We can try that. Nothing. So nothing there really. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it at the moment. It's just decoration and blast resistance and glowing and glass and lamps and walk through glass and other such stuff and ores um, and obviously quartz you can use for spikes and other things but uh, yeah that's pretty much it for that uh, thanks so much for watching and goodbye I'll cover the world gen and how it sort of does things and configs in the next video